Welcome to the Healthy OC segment on Real Orange. I'm Heidi Cortese. Do you have diminished or changed visual color perception? Are straight lines starting to appear distorted? If you are over 45, you may be experiencing age-related macular degeneration. Our guest, Dr. Sam Garg, medical director of the Gavin Herbert Eye Institute at UC Irvine, will tell you what you can do to slow the progression of this eye disease. Welcome, Dr. Garg. Thank you for having me. Ay, yay, yay. So many terms. What is macular degeneration? Well, it's best to think of the eye as a camera and there's multiple parts to it, and the front part being the cornea, inside is a lens which becomes a cataract with time, and in the back of the eye is the film, and that's the retina. The retina has different parts to it, but the center part where we have our uh, high definition vision, if you would say, is the macula, and that has the most concentration of recept photoreceptors which take the image that we see, convert it into a neuron signal and onto the brain. Um, that's the macula, and with, with time, that can degenerate and that's called macular degeneration. Uh, it, the condition is actually known more often than not as age-related macular degeneration. Does that mean that if we live long enough, eventually all of us are going to get it? Not exactly. Uh, age-related macular degeneration is more common as we age. Um, about, if you live to about age 80, there's a 30% chance of having macular degen degeneration, uh, but it's not in everyone past the age of you know, 50, 60, 70. <laughs> Uh, are there uh, are both eyes affected, or can one eye just be affected? It usually happens in both eyes, but to differing degrees. There's different types of macular degeneration. The more common type uh, is known as dry macular degeneration, and that's in about 90% of patients. Uh, that is more of a overall just aging change uh, deposits within the retina. Um, there's no good cure for that. It's just sort of monitoring it. Um, the more Dangerous type and the, the, the type that affects your vision um, more profoundly is what's called the wet type or uh, exudative macular degeneration. This is what really causes visual loss. Now, what are some of the things a person can do to uh, help stop the progress of this uh, condition? In the dry form, you know, you want to have regular exams, um, eye, uh, like sunlight protection, sunglasses. Uh, antioxidants have been found to be helpful and definitely stop smoking. That's one of the major risk factors for uh, the dry type. The wet type is, uh, involves medical treatments and up until a few years ago the treatments uh, would cause the visual loss to stabilize. We wouldn't be able to get anything back but over the last few years we have a new class of treatments called um, anti-VEGF or vascular endothelial growth factor treatments which can be administered to actually prevent loss of vision, actually regain vision as well. And our, our institute is also involved in different ways of um, restoring vision. And one of the most exciting ways is stem cells. And we have a, um, some researchers within our department that are using uh, stem cells to help see if those will, in early stages now, uh, to see if that will help regenerate the retina to, um, to restore you know, the normal function of the macula. Um, there's other ways, you know, if it's gone beyond that, um, I'm involved in a trial involving a mini telescope, in, in, in planting a mini, a mini telescope in, inside the eye to actually magnify the image to restore vision. So there's lots of different ways that we're looking at ways to uh, improve vision in macular degeneration. So there isn't really a cure per se, but there are things one can do to prevent further degeneration of the macula. I, if I have macular degeneration, what can I see? What can't I see? Can you tell us yeah, what, like that, a, what that is yeah. exactly? Macular degeneration affects the center of your vision. So uh, you would have a splotch over you know, someone's face, uh, just say. This is different than other ailments in the eye. Cataracts cause an overall dimming of vision uh, everywhere, and uh, glaucoma affects the sort of periphery of the vision. So you have good central vision, but the uh, periphery is dimmed. Uh, macular degeneration affects sort of the high definition part of your vision, the center. So sort of like seeing um, the target without the bullseye in the center. Exactly. exactly. Well, thank you for a wonderful uh, visit and all this great information. Um, the eyes have it. That wraps this segment of the Healthy OC on Real Orange. I'm Heidi Cortese.